Hey guys, it's your girl Bonnie and I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing a quick like 10 minute get ready with me, how to do your makeup when you got kids, how to do your makeup when you're in a rush and you just don't have time but you still want to look half decent. If that's you, <laughs> or that's you most of the time, just keep watching this video. I'm just going to clip back my hair so it's out of the way and let's get straight into this video because I just don't have time. Hence why I'm making this video. <laughs> I'm going out today and I just don't have time. Instead of doing your eyebrows first, I recommend just going straight in with foundation. I'm using the Dewy Smooth Fit Me Foundation. Make sure you cake that moisturizer on because that's what's going to help your foundation look good. And also dewy foundations are good unless you have oily skin and definitely go for a dry one. But yeah, instead of doing your eyebrows first, you want to do your foundation first because we just don't have time to do that. I'm using the shade uh, 210 in Sandy Beige, if you're like similar shade to me, then get you this one. It's nice, it looks a bit orange at first. Um, but once you put like concealer on and you set it, it does have more of a nicer bronzy yellow undertone. I don't know if you guys can notice if you watch my videos, <laughs> but my eyebrows look really small. I don't know, maybe not. But because I did them yesterday, I do my own eyebrows myself. Um, but I haven't done my eyebrows in a while. I've just been letting them be free. But yeah, yesterday I was like, oh, you know what? Because normally I just like pluck them a bit and then I'm just like, yeah, that, that's good enough. But yesterday I was just like, nah, let me go in. <laughs> so I did. And yeah, and then straight after, you just want to put a little bit of highlighter, highlighter, concealer. This is the e.l.f. camo concealer in the shade Fair, Warm Fair. I kid you not, this will be like a 10 minute makeup video, that's it. Eyelashes and all. It's just, you need to know what to do when you're in a rush. Like, when you get out of the shower or whatever, if you're not having a shower, cake some moisturizer on before you do your makeup. Put on your foundation as quick as possible. Put on that concealer, boom. Now we're on to powder. The Fit Me uh, Loose. The Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in the shade Fair. And then just go under. You don't need to bake like um, leaving it for long. You just, you don't need to bake, okay? My words are like all over the place. You don't need to bake, you just need to set. Do everything nice and quickly. Should you just go in with a big brush, even though you probably want to powder your whole face with this, with this sponge to make everything so perfect. You can do it at the end. Go in with a big brush, go over your face, everywhere. And then if you really want, you can just go over with a sponge to push everything in. Nice. And then boom. Straight onto bronzer. I'm not gonna tell you this bronzer because I don't recommend it. <laughs> I just have it for the meantime. Well, it it's the BYS um, Island Bronze or whatever. It's all right, but I don't recommend it. <laughs> you see it and you like it, then yeah. I it's all right for now. So I mean, I do recommend it if you can't afford um, other bronzer. I just don't have time to go get a bronzer. I could order it online. Oh, I could, I'm so dumb. <laughs> Together. Then you want to go in with like a tighter brush and contour that nose very quickly. Your beauty blender and just try to blend it out a bit okay and then also while i'm doing this you want to put your bronzer on your eyelids as well if you want a little something something 
I didn't even, I don't think I concealed my eyelids. I just put on um, foundation because once again, we're in a rush. And I don't think I set my eyelids either. So it makes it look like you put effort in, but really you didn't. <laughs> blend, blend, blend. Blend, blend, blend. On the side here, you just wanna touch it up so it doesn't look weird. I'm gonna go in with my Essence for Back to Nature palette and just go in with some blush, just very lightly. Just brush it away. Go in with your highlighter, which if you know me, you know I always go into my James Charles palette and I use the highlighting shade. It's not even a highlighting shade, it's just a shimmery shade. I just love it. Put it on the tip of your nose to make your nose look snatched and like the middle part here. That's what's really gonna help your nose look snatched in your inner corner. And I'm just going to go over with any sort of brow powder. I normally go on with pomade but since I'm in a rush I'm going in with brow powder. And then you just want to fill in your natural shape. Because if you're in a rush, you ain't got time to be spending a lot of time on the eyebrows, but they can still look nice. It just means you'll be giving off more of a natural brow, not so, you know. <laughs> you just want to spoil it on the other side. Try to make it as even as possible. And if you are going for more of a natural brow, you do want to make them look like wispy, like it's like them on purpose. <laughs> um, I'm just going to spray my face with um, the Makeup Finishing Spritz by Astralis. And then I'm going to put some glue on my lashes. These are... These are FA lashes and I'm just putting the duo glue on them and while they're drying I'm just going to quickly go on with some mascara And then I'm also gonna do my lips. <sighs> Sorry, my camera, my camera cut off for some reason, but I'm going in. So we're gonna kill time while the lashes are drying. I'm going in with the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade London. The one that I always use because it just suits me the best. And now we're going to go on with the lashes. Girl, these lashes just, they went on. Try to find, like, if you don't have time for lashes, you can just do mascara or whatever. But um, if you do do lashes try to get you a pair of lashes that just go straight on last but not least you want to put a shimmery shade under your brow i'm just using the james charles of course the shimmery shade 
And that's pretty much it, you guys. I'm just going to take out these pins. Um, I normally put on lip gloss, but I'm kind of feeling this lip right now. I'll probably take lip gloss with me um, for when it starts going crusty, <laughs> just in case. Um, but yeah, this is the finished look, you guys. And I did this in literally 10 to 15 minutes. It was pretty quick. Um, probably 15 minutes because of the lashes but um, yeah and I look put together I look like I put a lot of effort in this makeup but I didn't so yeah <laughs> um, don't forget to like share and subscribe and hit that bell down below if you want to stay tuned for more videos and yeah I'll see you guys next video next video I'm probably posting a vlog so make sure you go check that out and yeah, I love you guys. Bye.